Hey guys and girls, welcome back to Let's Play some God Eater 3, where we left off. The operation is continuing. Operation, bring back my daughter. Bring back Fiend. Um, as uh, we just got the go-ahead from Hugo. We're gonna go see what happens next. I am kind of afraid for Hugo's life, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but let's hope things work out. Because he took on the job of luring an Ash Origami toward us. I trust Hugo's skills, but... You never know with these things. Hey, cutscene. There it is. It's Hugo's signal. Right. Let's see what he's got. This is your show, Hugo. Go for it. of our own I'll make sure you receive it <laughs> the origami look at that thing alert ash origami in pursuit of unidentified trailer hmm? what Blow that thing up. Yo, showing off now, Hugo. Start running. Right for her. So Hugo's gonna jump in there and grab her. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Look, she's just being thrown around in that thing. Alright, we gotta get her out of there. Time to end this. Jesus, but she's in there, right? What was the plan of for her? Oh my lord Loving the cuts <sighs> There's reckless and then there's Hugo <laughs> Everyone get ready to move out Understood now headed toward the fallen container Let's go. There she is. Grab her. Pick her up. Get her out of there. Do something. Theme. Get that off of her. It looks like she's okay. Great. Now let's skedaddle. Get that collar off of her. I want her emotions back. Oh, what is that? Oh no! It's seen us. Hold it. Is something up? Be quiet. Too late. It's located us. Ashborn. Oh no. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Don't hit her! Wait, Hugo? I... It's my... It's my responsibility, so... I'll 
I'll decide for myself what I'm going to do. Look over here, Aragami! Team! I... I can't... I won't let you take her!
Oh my god. We somehow... I guess we didn't have to kill it, which is fine. Fine by me. We heard it, though. Broke a lot of its pieces. Somehow. That got a little hairy. Anyway, that sure was a hell of an entrance, Claire. I give you ten out of ten for that one. I'm just glad I made the time. <laughs> Thanks for the support there, Claire. Whew, we got her. My daughter. You did well. Our mission was a success. It looks like we managed to survive again, Hugo. <laughs> yeah, it seems we both had our share of bad luck on that one. From what I hear, the folks on the transport are all safe, though. How about that? We're all heroes who rescued a transport from the fearsome Ash Aragami. <laughs> Hugo? That's like firefighter arson. Come on, let's not get technical. More importantly, though... Claire, are you sure about this? Yes, I made my decision. All right. I just wanted to be sure. Yep. Made him barren. Oh. Are you all right? Yay! <laughs> she hugged me. It was Aww. <laughs> I'm sorry. You've only just gotten back with Fiend, and we've already had a call come through from Gleipnir. No doubt it's about her. Yep, go figure. Don't worry. Everything's going exactly as we planned. Now is when things will really start moving. Be ready. I'm ready. I'm not letting Fiend out of my sight again. These guys ain't taking her. Uh, okay. There can be no room for leniency. That's gonna be your answer, is it? Watch what you say, Hugo. However, the decision does seem lopsided to me. We applaud the way that the cargo was safeguarded from Ash Aragami during its arduous journey to reach us. The response to the assault on the transport was handled admirably. If that's the case, Despite those achievements, the unveiling of the cargo manifest was a major breach of our contract. Furthermore, according to a detailed report from Inukai, the highly classified cargo was improperly handled, greatly reducing its usefulness to us as a specimen. There are no excuses for this. Damn! That bastard Inukai! Gleipnir will begin the process of seeking damages from Chrysanthemum. We will press charges of wrongdoing under Ashland Navigation Law for this outrage. As for you ages, you can expect to meet a fire wow. squad. This incident was the result of my personal mismanagement. It was my responsibility. They are not at fault. In fact, they risked their lives to protect... You are a scion of House Victorious. You should know that I owe a certain debt to your father for his guidance. Wait quietly during these proceedings. I won't make this hard for you. I'm telling you that I'm the one responsible. <laughs> Very well, I'll speak frankly. You absolutely do not have the power to take responsibility for this. You owe your very life to House Victorious. Avoid any and all deeds that would sully that name. Could it be that you are simply failing to comprehend your own true value? Wow. This dude's an a-hole. 
What is it? Sir, a large ash origami has broken through our second cordon and is approaching at high speed. What's that? Oh, man. That's a real shame. Ash origami are tough to crack. Listen, all of you. Go out and fight that ash origami. You can at least buy us some time. <laughs> no, thanks. We've got a date with a firing squad, remember? Yeah. He's right. A quick execution does sound a lot better than being eaten by an origami. You're, you're in no We're in every position, too. How about if the Ash Origami were defeated and you were safe again, would you reconsider your decision then? <laughs> defeated? That is absolutely impossible. It's a large Ash Origami. We'll beat it. By my family's name, I will defeat it. Alongside my <laughs> companions. Hell yeah. I know that look. The daughter of the great man Randall Victorious has most certainly inherited her father's valor. Uh. I am currently away from headquarters, so you will have to forgive my greeting you remotely. Allow Abraham Gadolin, Chief Commander of Gleipnir. Gadolin, Chief Commander Damn. Of Gleipnir at your service. Governor General Gadolin. Oh, what's a Governor General want with us? I must admit it. We lack the capability to deal with that Ash Aragami. Thus, would you companions not lend us your strength in this time of need? Listen, Governor General. We don't have a problem with helping you, but we're going to need collateral. We'd be risking our lives. You can offer us appropriate compensation? I overheard your earlier conversation. I will bargain in good faith. Governor General, do we have your word on this? That will depend upon the results. The first condition we will is beat survival. It. Don't worry. Okay then. We have ourselves a deal. Now, sit back and watch what we can do. Hell yeah. We're taking this thing out. We're gonna show these bastards what what being the hounds is all about. Ash Argami can't touch me. These things are nothing. <laughs> My voice cracked. I'm sorry. Right. <laughs> We're gonna win though. <laughs> uh, give me my balls back. <laughs> I know how that sounds, but don't don't take it out of context. Oh uh, God. Okay. Okay. Um. So Hope's here. Don't know if I need to talk to her yet, though. Is it the same one we fought? Come on, let me craft something. Scale edge. Not what I want, though. I hate you. I'm like only missing one for like almost everything, which is stupid. Hey, you're back. Hold up. Let me talk to her real quick. I knew you'd come for me, Daddy. Thanks, Daddy. I love you. I love you too, baby. <laughs> My little girl. She's so cute. Oh, what you got? You got anything good? Anything interesting? What about materials? Oh, you're flat broke on things. We got a weakness counter for for what we're dealing with. Unique Ashborn. Fire is his weakness. Okay. Take Hugo with us. So we can drop. We can we can uh, equip the fire weapon. Be ready for this. All right, we're gonna do this next time. Um, yeah, leave a like, subscribe, share with a friend. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you then. Bye bye.